Good afternoon. It is about 11.20 on Friday and I am here with my roommate Kim. Hello. And we are going to be making, well, she's going to be making bread for the first time, but we're gonna be making bread together. So I hope you guys enjoy this. It's going to be interesting. <laughs> I don't know what's gonna be good or bad. <laughs> well, last week was my first time making bread and I messed up like three or four steps, but it's okay, it turned out fine, but it's just gonna be interesting. A journey, for sure. So I went ahead and I have, if we come over here, I went ahead and started warming up the water on the stove. So we're almost at the point where we can go ahead and prove the yeast. So yeah, we'll go ahead and get started. Of course, bread takes a really long time to make. If you've ever make, made bread, you would know that it's not like a one and done kind of thing. It takes like three or four hours, but it's a lot of fun. Okay, so we messed up and the water is a little too hot. It will actually kill the yeast. <laughs> so our yeast is sitting over there while Kim is prepping all of the dry ingredients. So right now she is gonna go over here Look at that concentration. Or are you making a mess? <laughs> it's okay. Bread messy. Bread making is supposed to be messy. Uh -huh. Should I do that? Do you want another? Do you want a smaller measuring cup? No. Okay. You really made a mess there. It's a pretty mess. <laughs> it's gonna be a yummy mess once it's finished. It's my dedicated work mess. <laughs> it's okay. You have to be a little messy when you cook. That's four. Yes. Look at all that flour. Isn't that five? So much flour. Here we go. We lost count. That's four, I told you. It's five. Oh, it's five? Okay. Yeah, it's five. Oops. Five. Perfect. Yay! Yay. A close so up of you huge. doing the thing. Oh, look at that. Now it's becoming like doughy. You're doing so well. I'm so proud of you. You know, because even though you're recording it. Yeah, we have different, different angles. Yeah, look at us. Cinema. 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 Cinema photography. Okay, so here's the bread. And now we're going to tuck it in under its little cloth. And it's going to go night night. It's got to proof for about an hour. So, yeah. Me and Kim are going to do some homework in the meantime, and we'll see you guys in an hour. <laughs> so as you guys are guessing, it's definitely done. We just need to knead it, divide it, and let it rest. Bread. <laughs> Hi, future Avery here. Um, so this is on the bread video, and I'm editing... And I looked at the footage and realized that my phone had died and I had said that I was going to like put butter on the bread and stuff and like give it to my roommates and completely like phone just bloop and I was like oh my god. So we ate it while it was still really hot. It was really good. Everyone enjoyed it. Um, I will put the recipe down below in the description so if you guys do want to follow along or even try to get, make your own bread you can follow that recipe down below. It is super easy. It's actually the same recipe my mom uses. I love it. It makes like sweet bread so the rolls toned out really good. They kind of reminded me a little bit of King's Hawaiian rolls which are chef's kiss. But anyways, it turned out really good. I'm super proud of Kim. I'm super impressed with her. She did a really good job for her first time ever making bread. And yeah, anyways, thank you for watching, guys. I appreciate you. And I enjoy every single one of you. Thank you so much for supporting me. And thank you for watching me and Kim struggle through making bread. <laughs> um, I hope you guys enjoy actually like that was such a fun and relaxing video to make because I really didn't have to plan out anything I make bread every Friday and she just wanted to join along so I'm so glad that she joined along with me if anyone has any questions or wants to just leave any comments you can go ahead down in the description box if you aren't subscribed don't forget to subscribe and just spread some positivity today anyways once again, I love and appreciate every single one of you. Have a good day.